you know, a program can only go so far, you know, with the theory, but in practice. And so it's the people that definitely make it uh, worthwhile. UNK is different in that it will offer the sense of community to its students. For all of the professors, and this is across the board, they are willing to spend so much time with you. You know, if you contact them, say, hey, I'm, I'm not understanding this part of it. So can you explain it a little bit more? They're more than happy to do that. They, they're glad to do it and they're excited to share what they know with you. There is a real unity and passion for students and a heart for that and a focus for that, for students and student success in our program. That's um, unlike anything I've seen in other places. Um, and so my colleagues, their just brilliant abilities to do research and teaching and balance all of that, but always keeping um, things focused on student um, success. I get to help students, regardless of where they are, whether they're undergraduates or graduates, freshmen or senior, you know, whatever, to achieve their dreams and go off and achieve great things. And I don't know that there's a whole lot of things that are more empowering than that. I definitely felt connected to the UNK community, even though it was an online program. They really make an effort that you're not an extra student, but you are a part of the history department just as much as someone who's on campus. It's important because, if, especially if you're a distance student, you need to have a lot of interaction with faculty because when it's electronic interaction, or maybe if a telephone interaction, it, 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 has to be, it has to be a real open channel and you get that. The way the courses were structured, the amount of input and assistance you get from faculty, and then the way that the structure of the courses helps pull students together so that they learn to communicate with each other and share ideas with each other, it's, it, it was a really good setup. I would say the discussion boards are one of the biggest things about the classes, besides, you know, papers, um, but just the fact that you get to know the other students really well through that. We're all over the United States and actually some of the students are international and so we really get diverse perspectives on things. It's not everybody situated in one little town and that has created amazing debates in class where we've you know taken different cultural aspects of just the places that we live and brought it into a discussion of history. It allows your eyes to be opened up so much more than you ever thought imaginable just being in the classroom. So I really really like that um, because it just gets you thinking. The feedback they give you becomes instrumental. You feel like you're in this together, especially when you, you take the thesis option rather than the, the comprehensive exams. You're a support system for one another. You can say, hey, is this, you know, is this a good title? And they're like, no, let's try something else. And you're like, okay, yep, that's, that's great to know. And then the sense that someone else is doing the same thing, you're not alone. I know it sounds kind of cheesy, but you're going to make some really good friends too, and that's, that's a great thing.